Okay, this question is a frequency distribution question. So we want to draw this out really quickly. And we can see that there are these different intervals down here on the x-axis. And they're broken up into a total of seven. That looks like one more. Sneak that guy in. And the thing about this, though, is you don't want to necessarily try to figure out the exact number. And in this case, what are the exact numbers? Well, the exact numbers, just drawing this last one here. Now you're actually I'm going to show you something cool because I'm only going to draw this much. I'm going to show you why. So talking about the exact numbers again, what are these exact numbers? Well, the average of these 95 measurements. Now, do you think the GRE wants you to really figure that out? The answer is no. <laughs> they want you to figure out a shortcut, a logical way to break down the problem in less than a minute if possible. And as we're going to see in a second, it is possible. And in quantity B, we have the median. So and actually, let's put the average the 95 measurements, and in B we have the median. That's the important part. Now, what is, what's the difference between the two? Well, the average would be to add up all of these intervals all the way down to there, divide by the number, which would be 95. And of course, that takes forever. But let's start here with the median. The median is simply the number in the middle. So we have here 15 of these guys and 35 here in this middle interval. We'll even write this intervals out really quickly here, 6 and 10. So you can see that are already 50, 15 plus 35, 50 of the intervals are here and then here. So the middle number is somewhere in this 35, because remember, there's a total of 95. So the middle number is 47 and 48, which still encompasses 6 through 10. So the median would be 6 through 10. Now, let's think of the average. So the median, put that interval between 6 through 10. So now let's look at the average. Well, if we were to add these together, here's 15. And the 11 to 15 interval over here also has 15. The average of this, because everything is balanced out, would be also in a six, the 6 to 10 interval, just like that. However, now for the average, we're adding it. We're kind of making it lean towards the right or go this way. That is because we're putting numbers here at these higher intervals. And even though they're not that strong, just a little. In fact, even if we were to discount these just by having this guy right here, this skews the average so it's somewhere to the left of 6 through 10. So therefore, it's greater than the median. And the answer is A.